Hey everyone, we wanted to take uh, just a moment to talk to you about our upcoming Sunday night Bible class uh, streaming uh, live at five o'clock. Uh, we've been following, if you've been joining us on Sunday nights, we've been following uh, some references that are taken out of Jude as Jude references the Old Testament and uh, in warning his readers about false teachers. But we're going to take a break from that for a moment. Uh, just given all of the unrest uh, in our society right now, we wanted to open God's word and, and take a moment to look at what God says about uh, how we treat others and, and sometimes how our pride gets in the way. Yeah, and we're going to take a look at a book that we probably don't look at a lot, one of the minor prophets. You know, we usually go to Jonah when we want some minor prophet. Uh, but we're going to look at Obadiah. Obadiah is one of the smallest books, maybe the smallest book in the Old Testament. And even though it's small, I think it packs in a lot of information that, that is really relevant to us today and how we view people that are different than us and how we need to treat people in every aspect of life. Absolutely, Jacob. And so if you would, before Sunday night, uh, take some time to, to review Obadiah. I'm going to bet it's been a minute since you read it. Uh, take some time to review the story of Jacob and Esau uh, found in Genesis and, and uh, all that went around their birth and, and the birthright and those things. And, and also even in Malachi, there are some references to Jacob and Esau that will help us to understand the context of Obadiah a little better and also help us to understand how that context applies to what we're facing today. We hope that you join us. We understand that we've been fractured and we're still trying to do a lot of this uh, digitally and, and connecting and studying the Bible with one another. Uh, but we hope that this study is beneficial to you. And again, we welcome any, any feedback that you have for us that we might make this the, the most effective study for everybody involved. Right. We're excited and we hope you guys are excited too. Thank you. See you Sunday.